Hi, Mom. It's Jessica and Kaden from Diary Fit Mom. Second post of the day. That's rarity. Um, so we're having one of those days. We were all set up to go to the gym, had everything packed, and you know how fun that is, getting yourself and a little one ready. Um, I get to the car, look in the window, and my keys are locked in, and my husband has taken the keys, my spare keys, to work with him. And he works about 40 minutes out, and he just had five days off, so what are you going to do? Um, so we're stuck at home, <laughs> and of course it was one of those days where I really could have used a workout break. Um, little man here is cutting a <laughs> top tooth, and is pretty whiny. Hey? And we were dressed for the day, but somebody spilled cold coffee all over himself. And that's my fault. He loves to play with Tim Hortons cups. So, you know, whatever keeps him happy today. It's been one of those days my dogs are being terrible. So we're just going to get through today. And on days like today, I love coffee anyways, but it's on a day like today, I really need an extra little kick. And I'm really craving chocolate. I'm less than five weeks out. And I really, really, really just want some chocolate and some donuts and cake and everything. So I'm going to share my protein coffee recipe, with, which really helps me with my... Sorry, I'm just trying to get this camera a little better. Which really helps with my craving <laughs> and uh, also gives you a protein boost and a little caffeine boost. So, um, yeah. What I like to start with, this is my favorite one right now, it's Timothy's... German chocolate cake, so just a little cake cup. Um, sometimes I use hazelnut, sometimes I just use plain black coffee. Um, I use a Keurig. I've already brewed my coffee because this is my second time doing this. The first time my video didn't save, so, and too bad because it was awesome. The little man stuck his hand in the coffee. Thank goodness it was lukewarm, but yeah. Ugh, one of those days, like I said. Anyway, so what I do is I start with a brewed, I brew my K-cup, yeah, I'll try to do it again. Um, I use the medium setting on the Keurig, just to try to make your coffee a little bit stronger because it will be diluted a little bit, just from adding the protein and the water. And you can have a shake cup with um, your favorite protein. I used 15 grams, which is about half a scoop for this serving of protein, and about three ounces of water, just because I don't like watery coffee. And I use a lukewarm temperature, um, too hot, and you're going to cook the protein. It's going to form chunks of um, nasty, gross things that you don't want in your coffee. And too cold, you're going to cool your coffee right down. You can do it that way. Just heat it up in the microwave or whatever. Or if you are like my husband and like lukewarm coffee, then perfect. Um, I'm using this protein right now. It's called Rule, ah, Rule 1, and it's chocolate fudge flavor. I love the taste of this. Um, yeah, I'm just really liking it. It's super chocolatey, which is really helping with my cravings and getting through prep. Mama's here. Um, so what I do is I, I took half a scoop. If you like chocolatier and you have the macros to work with, or if you're not counting macros and you need some extra protein, just use a full scoop, maybe just a little bit of extra water. So you shake that up. Like I said, I've already done this once, so... Mine's already shaken and in my coffee, but then you would just pour it in your coffee. Um, if you want it hotter, just heat it up. And because I am less than five weeks out, I'm pretty modest with my, um, like, I'm making it pretty simple just to save on calories and macros. Because I'm hungry all the time, I want to eat my, eat my macros rather than drink them. Oh, honey, please stay out of that. Good thing it's cold, so you know what I mean? Not really. <laughs> He's a coffee fiend already. Um, but great ideas is you can, uh, to make this even better, um, low fat or fat free cool whip. Some people crucify me for that because it's full of chemicals, but I like it. Um, also you can make a healthier version of whipped cream with just full fat coconut milk mixed with some icing sugar, um, and just... <laughs> whip that up and it makes a nice frothy whipped cream that's healthier and full of good fats so you can do that but like I said I'm being pretty modest um, I'd rather eat my calories than drink them at this point but after prep I'm looking forward to making some delicious iced coffees with this recipe so anyways I hope this helps and gives my fit moms the 
caffeine and protein boost that they need today and hopefully you guys are having a more productive and a little less chaotic day but that's usually the day in the life of a mom right we're busy we're our plans often get messed up and this baby brain apparently I'm told it never goes away and let me tell you on prep it is way way worse so stay active and I hope you guys have a great day